And that was the reason that I left Croatia, my home, my family, my friends and relatives, because of communism. And communism was gone. I was feeling to come home yet again. An election was in April 2019, and I came back a month later. I was so eager to come back home. I was coming from airport, I stopped in one restaurant on the barbecued lamb, whole lamb, and I ordered the lamb for the lunch, and they brought me some wine, and I looked at the wine, and I smelled the wine, and I tasted the wine, I couldn't drink it. <laughs> it was such a bad quality, because during communism, quality is not important quantity yeah. everything was judged by quote, quote quantity so i came and immediately my heart that i should do something if ever some my friend comes to croatia <laughs> to show the beauty of croatia that he can have a decent wine <laughs> <laughs> so one well, then president dutchman invited me and we discussed it what can I do for Croatia? I immediately accepted that I'll start winery in Croatia, which will produce world-class wines. And I made stainless steel jacket tanks in Santa Rosa, <laughs> so that wine wine can be produced at a cool temperature, even controlled temperature. And I ordered the French limousine barrels from France so that wine can age into French limousine oak as world class wines are made. So I made condition that my dream can come true. And it did. So that second vintage of my wine that I made in Croatia was chosen to present Croatian wine industry in the United Nations. That was the biggest event of my life. Oh, <laughs> 28 journalists was waiting for me to taste my wine. <laughs> and uh, so I cannot describe how happy I was. But anyhow, I think that my coming to Croatia has uh, started other winemakers to think about lifting quality up so that if my friends come to Croatia that they can have a world class wine. <laughs> so thank you. So, thank you.